Iran might attack Israel in the early hours of Sunday to retaliate the earlier attack on the Iranian diplomatic mission in Syria, a high-ranking U.S. official told the Al Jazeera television channel. The official said that the U.S. was deeply concerned about the prospect of a large-scale attack on Israel. It is highly likely that Iran will begin an attack on Israel early tomorrow morning, on Sunday morning. The comments come amid heightened tension in the region. Israel on Friday said it intercepted around 40 missiles from Lebanon where Iran-linked Hezbollah militants are stationed. U.S. President Joe Biden on Friday warned Iran not to attack Israel. Meanwhile, Israel is on high alert and has closed schools and canceled activities due to possible Iranian attack. Starting tomorrow morning and during the next few days, none of the educational systems, camp programs, and planned trips will take place, IDF spokesperson Rear Admiral Daniel Hagari said in a video statement. The country has declared open the bomb shelters, while the country's foreign minister has postponed upcoming visits to Austria and Hungary. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu held a meeting with Defense Minister Yov Gallant in the Israeli security echelon at the Hatzor Israeli Air Force Base, where they discussed the possible Iranian attack. Iranian Navy commandos on Saturday seized a container ship affiliated with Israel near the Strait of Hormuz, state news agency Erna reported. Erna identified the ship as MCS Ares and claimed it is managed by a company owned by Israeli billionaire Eyal Ofer. The Portuguese Fagid ship was taken under the control of Iran's Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps Navy with the help of a helicopter. The ship was on its way from the UAE to India when the landing party disembarked. The ship had turned off its tracking data, which has been common for Israeli-affiliated ships moving through the region. After that, the ship was diverted to the territorial waters of Iran. A video circulated on media showed commandos raiding the alleged ship near the Strait of Hormuz by helicopter. The incident comes amid heightened tension in the region. Israel on Friday reported intercepting around 40 missiles fired from the territory of Lebanon where Iran-affiliated Hezbollah is stationed. The attack raised fears of possible Iranian attack on Israel. U.S. President Joe Biden made a statement on Friday, warning Iran not to attack Israel. Hey, things up, don't come out. Hey, things up. Better go to bridge. Hey, things up, don't come out. Hey, things up. Chop for them. Better go to bridge. 